Hey, 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 what up, people? Um, I'm posting this video a day after Veterans Day, and um, I would just like to say, you know, thank you to all the troops that are serving, but that's not really what this video is about. Just wanted to make a quick, uh, a quick, uh, mention to the veterans, but the point of this video is to talk about, um, video games that are coming out, and, uh, what you think about PS4 and Xbox One, so let's, uh, jump right in. Before we get started, I would just like to mention that this is some, uh, more Halo 3 gameplay on, um, Guardian, and the next, uh, gameplay is gonna be on the Narrows. Um, I'm still playing Halo 3 because you guys aren't giving me any, you know, recommendations of video games to play. As I said in the last video, which I posted yesterday, I'll play any video game you guys want. Just comment below and, uh, tell me, because I'm sure you're getting bored of Halo 3 by now. Um, so what other videos should I make, uh, what other video games should I, uh, capture footage of? Just comment below and tell me. So the first thing I want to talk about is Call of Duty Ghosts. Um, I recently played it as a, at a friend's house, um, and it was, uh, it was pretty good fun. Um, the campaign looked awesome, though I didn't really want to watch any of it because I didn't want to, you know, ruin it for myself. Um, but I played multiplayer, multiplayer was awesome, and I tried Extinction. Uh, Extinction was a little not too fun in my opinion, because it felt like, you know, in Zombies you were running around and stuff, and I don't know, it just, I felt like in Extinction was like, grab the drill, put it in here, and then we'll wait until this is done, and then after we... Uh, and then we'll move it to another place, and then it was just kind of, I don't know. I didn't really enjoy it, but what did you think about Call of Duty Ghost? Has he, have you played it yet? I I recently just played it over the weekend, and I, I enjoyed it. Uh, so what do you think? Comment below. Uh, tell me that also. But now I want to cover some games that are soon to come out. Um, I'm going to get PS4. Um, some games I'm going to get right away. Uh, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Call of Duty Ghosts, maybe Battlefield 4, but I highly doubt it. Um, what else? Destiny in the beta, Dying Light, which looks pretty awesome. And um, nothing else really right now. I'm trying to think. Um, and if Halo 5 does turn out to be released for PS4, because rumors have been going around that that may happen, I'll probably pick up that too. I'll, I'll definitely pick that up. Halo is a great series, and... I have some doubts so far about Halo 5, depending on what I'm hearing, but, you know, I'm gonna, if it comes on PS4, then I'll definitely pick it up and give it a try. I mean, next gen is coming fast, um, PS4 is coming out on Friday, that is crazy. It's just, it's coming so fast, um, it's gonna be a crazy week, um, everybody's gonna be going for their PS4s and the next week Xbox Ones, and... They're already giving some of these consoles away, and I've been hearing that they're awesome, and I I really can't wait. It's it's going to be great. Um, first thing I'm going to do on Friday when I get home, looking up some PS4 gameplay. I mean, it, it, it's so crazy, um, everything that's, you know, happened in the past with all these video games coming out, and it's, it's crazy. And I'm waiting until Christmas to pick up my uh, PS4. Um, PS4 because, from what I've heard, it sounds like the better console. Um, I'm not dissing Xbox One or anything. Xbox One looks great. It's just, um, from what I've seen, um, X, or PS4 does seem to be the better console in terms of games and graphics, and I, I really like the look of the controller. Um, I really hated the PS3 controller. Uh, tried it a few times, you know, at some friend's house that didn't have Xbox, and I, I really didn't like it, um, it just didn't feel comfortable, but everybody who's gotten their hands on PS4 controller says it looks, or it feels, it feels great in your hands, which I am very, very excited for. But some cons of PS4, um, I heard that, um, it will not have external hard drives for a while, um, it will not have a lot of good exclusives, which I'm not really mad about, um, and that's, that's about it for PS4, um, this is the gameplay on the Narrows that I was talking about, I didn't do very well here, but, um, 
Anyway, um, Xbox One, um, the pros, the controller also looks very comfortable, um, you know, you can live stream movies and stuff, um, it, it looks, it just looks really sleek, um, same with the PS4, they both look really, like, really sleek, you know, next-gen consoles, and all the changes that they made from what they were originally gonna do, um, what they were originally gonna do was horrific, the, um, thing with no discs sharing and stuff and no used games I thought that was you know kind of a bad feature and same with everybody else I mean at the Sony press conference everyone was amazed and the Microsoft everyone was kind of like oh gosh this this isn't gonna be good but all the changes they made in the past few months I'm very surprised and it's given me a lot of hope um the Xbox one looks great uh, it, it does look like a very good console. It's going to be a close battle. I'm going to tell you that right now. It's going to be a very close battle. But some cons about the Xbox One. I'm sure you've already heard that it's more of an entertainment system than a game system. But, um, you know, it's still going to play games, of course. But it won't have as better graphics as the PS4 will have. And, um... Uh, just in terms of how big the console is, it's going to be hard to fit all your, um... Like, everything you got, um, all your different, you know, uh, entertainment boxes, I don't know, what, uh, your VCR, if anybody still watches VHS tapes and your DVD player and all the stuff that you have to get your TV work and you're gonna have all that stuff and then you're gonna have a giant Xbox on there, Xbox One in there too and it's gonna be hard to fit everything. But I'm just saying, it's going to be a close battle. Um, I'm looking to get PS4. Uh, it, it, in my opinion, it does just it just looks sleeker, and I really like the trapezoid look of it. I, I just think it looks like a great... And the touchpad looks like a great addition to the uh, controller. I think overall the PS4 will win the console war, but that's just my opinion. It's going to be very, 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 very close. Um, I definitely think Xbox 360 won the last gen console war, or the what what the current gen right now, I should say. But um, uh, that that that's all I gotta talk about right now. This is PJ Nugget 333 saying I'm out.